Hey guys, Brian the Cell Phone Guy here again. Today we're going to take a quick look at how to do a software upgrade on the Sonom XP8. Now when this phone first shipped a couple of years ago, it was running Android 7 and I believe in January of uh, 20. 20 it uh, was upgradable to Android 8.1 and now it's finally available to upgrade this to Android 10. So let's just take a quick walk through and we'll show you how easy this is. Now one thing to keep in mind is that this is a fairly large update. It's about one and a half gigs so you might want to make sure that you're doing this on Wi-Fi unless you have unlimited data on your phone. So to begin with what we're going to do is we're going to go into the settings menu on the phone and then we're going to scroll down to system and then we're going to choose system update and it's going to tell us that the system update is available it tells us it's 1.15 gigs and if we want to download it we just tap on this and we hit continue and the download begins now this is going to take a significant amount of time so what i'm going to do is i'm just going to poise the Sorry, pause the camera, and then we're going to come back to this uh, once there's a new development. So if you get this warning here, it says installation will continue when device isn't being used. Tap now to, or to install now, tap resume. So we're just going to hit resume. And then we're back underway. So once again, we're just going to pause the camera because this is a fairly long process. Once we get to this phase where the download looks like it's completed, we're going to hit the restart now button. This rebooting phase will also take a few seconds, so just wait patiently while it reboots. And once it reboots, you'll see the time. And the time is most likely going to be a little bit off, so as we saw there, it just rebooted itself. And now it's just going to finish the app updates. It also reset the, uh, the screen display, so you may have to turn your uh, screen back on. And now that it's rebooted, we can see the change uh, on Android 8, the icons uh, were round. And on the Android 10 version, we see them as being square. But once again, if we go into settings, and we go into system, this tells us that the software was updated successfully. So we'll just delete that. And then if we go into system, we can see the changes have been the changes have been registered and here android version 10 so that's really all it is it's a very simple process it just takes a little bit of patience and like i say we do suggest that you do this on wi-fi uh, because it uh, at the size of the upgrade it can use up a significant amount of data that's all we have for now. If you like the video, give us a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button. If you have any questions, please reach out to me in the direct messaging and I'll do my best to get back to you. Thanks for watching.